Hi guys, there's something to talk about that's been kind of going on the past few days, and that is going to be that Autism Speaks. Guys, I hate, I'm wearing my I Don't Need a Cure shirt. Yeah, that's red. <laughs> anyway, so Autism Speaks has appointed a brand new ambassador. And not surprisingly, this person is not autistic. All right. Basically, every so often I'll go onto Twitter and I'll look up Autism Speaks and I will see kind of what's going on, you know, what people have said. And this one came up with this man wearing a like toque beanie thing against a puzzle piece background. So immediately, obviously, when I see puzzle pieces, red flags go off and I'm kind of like, okay. Anyway, so I did some looking into it and it turns out he is a gamer for some Clash game. I don't know, I don't really play games. Believe it or not, I don't. My Vegas, that's about it. Anyway, so he basically says how it's an honor and that his brother was autistic, but his brother passed. So he talks about his late brother a little bit. And I looked through the comments and there really wasn't any um, outrage yet. There really wasn't anybody disagreeing with him. It was his supporters and followers basically all congratulating him and saying how amazing it was and that kind of stuff. So he was thanking them. Some people just said, dude, you're the man. This is amazing. So I put some feelers out, posted in a couple groups, tagged a bunch of people. And I woke up in the morning with like 59 plus notifications and Twitter was crazy. And at this point, even still, Twitter is going crazy. So I wanted to send out a bunch of thank yous to everybody that has gotten involved and put their two cents in and let him know, CWA is his name on Twitter, that this is not okay with us. Why don't you consult us first? Um, some of his friends or his colleagues or whatever they are, are, you know, basically trying to speak on our behalf. And it's very frustrating when you see people who are trying to talk for people that they do not um, represent or they're not like part of the actual autistic community. So with that being said, you know, a lot of people are going to try to find redeeming qualities of Autism Speaks, but what they've done with their I Am Autism video and, um, you know, the advanced behavioral analysis therapies, which is trying to essentially, you know, rid your child of autism and try to make them act normal, that's not okay. They also have their MSSNG, which looks like missing. Um, program, which is all about con collecting, like, information about, like, people's DNA and genetic background and that kind of stuff. And they say it's to find treatments, but realistically, you can talk to a person and kind of figure out what their needs are and what they benefit from. I don't think that you need genetic testing to try to, like, help somebody. I think you need genetic testing if you want to figure out what genes are causing this problem and to make sure that it doesn't happen. So a lot of what Autism Speaks does is to try to get rid of us. So anyway, back to this gamer guy. He is, you know, very proud that he's um, an ambassador for Autism Speaks. He says we have a groupthink mentality and that we're essentially like and I don't know what words he used, but it almost sounded like he was insinuating that we were trolling him. But if a whole group of people that you're supposed to be representing comes to you and says, hey, dude, like, we appreciate the fact that you're trying to do something helpful and we know that you have a good heart, but please listen to us instead of talking about us, talking over us, trying to talk for us, because we know we live it every day and you don't. Like, it's awesome that you want to do something in your brother's memory. 
But there are so many of us out there that are trying to tell you something different. And we just hope that you take the chance to listen to us. And, you know, this is an ongoing saga. This is a, a lot of people are throwing their voices into the mix. And I hope that even if you don't get involved, that you read up on it. I'm going to leave a link in my description of this video so you can see kind of my breakdown of what has happened. Because sometimes when I'm typing, it comes a lot better than like this video. So, you know, it just comes out better, it flows out better, and you know, that's all I can ask for. So, don't support Autism Speaks. We don't need to care. We just need your support and your acceptance. Not awareness. I think people are aware. We just need to be accepted for who we are. So don't try to change us. We're perfect the way we are. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you check out my website, navigatingjourney.com, and connect with me on social media if you haven't already.